Hey guys, so I am going to go grocery shopping today. I'm going to take you guys with me because Matt gave me the idea and I was like, hey, I, I'll do it because I know some of you guys might be interested and I know um, Alicia from Dogger Key does and does this and I really love when she does like the cook with me videos, which is where I got the inspo from, as well as grocery shopping. So I'm at my store, Aldi, Aldi, whatever you want to call it. I call it Aldi. I got my quarter always on hand. This one's very dirty, um, but let's go grocery shopping. Okay, so I've actually never really done this before. Um, but as we come in, it's usually starting off with like chips and stuff like that. So let me let me change the angle. So normally they have goldfish here and they don't, but these are pretty much the same. Um, and I think my kids will like it for sure. So I'm gonna get these turtle baked things um, instead. I think they'll really like this actually. Sometimes you just gotta change it up, you know? Um, and I do have a list. I already have peanut butter jam. Oh, we need to get marmalade. So if you don't know, Matt loves marmalade. <laughs> and if you guys have ever gone to like the Delta Suite lounges when you travel, they always have marmalade on hand and it's so good. For some reason I won't eat it unless we're there, but this is a must and we just ran out. So we're coming along the bread section. Here's my favorite bread. So let's look for, oh, they have a really long expression taste. <laughs> so this is our favorite for French toast, the brioche loaf chocolate chips. We get a lot of bread, guys. So don't judge, please. Oh, and the croissants, oh my gosh. Normally I really like that, but I'm just gonna go for this today because um, I think those are like extra buttery and we put butter on our croissants. So I'm gonna just give this one. Oops. Good expiration dates. Love this. Okay, normally I'll pick up snacks like pretzel sticks, but we already have that. And I don't see anything that I should honestly get. So I'm gonna skip all of this always get the cotton candy grapes kids love these they always have it at aldi but i love to get cucumbers with these little ones they're so easy to just like eat with a meal because i love veggies so my kids literally tear up oranges like this will probably be gone in a week these little mini oranges they love these and these are actually better than the ones that i get from other grocery stores this is the Mandy's. So normally I will get a bunch of bananas and apples, but my dad, my mom and dad came over the other day to help watch and like, they'll just like randomly grab groceries sometimes that they know that we love and eat. So um, good on the bananas and good on the apples. I usually always get some bell peppers. So definitely want to get that. And I think I'm going to make steak um, subs this week, which maybe I should get the bread for it then. And it always goes good with onion and green peppers, so I'm gonna get green peppers too. It's always good to have a lot of peppers. I don't know about you guys, I love Roma tomatoes, so I'm gonna get like four. <laughs> so I'm not, obviously filming in public is kind of like weird when people look at you, but I'm just trying to be like confident about it. <laughs> um, I like to get the tomatoes that are kind of hard because they'll last a little longer. tomatoes. Matt doesn't really, well actually he's actually kind of allergic to tomatoes so it's usually just me but I'll go through these and actually our youngest son loves tomatoes so. So recently I've been getting these mini flour tortillas because it's just easier to make quesadillas with these so and it's super cheap. All right guys I didn't know if I was gonna share this but there was someone sitting outside right outside the Aldi doors um on the ground and he asked if I had any change and I, I don't really have change, I mean I literally just had that quarter. Um, so I asked him if there was anything he wanted to eat and you know I kind of put him on the spot but he's like chips and I was like oh is there anything healthy here? He's like oh you know just like anything so I'm trying to think about what I should do. I definitely want to help him but I don't know if chips is the best. I might get like one bag, small bag of chips but then like something else and I don't really know what to do. Again I didn't know if I wanted to share that but you know maybe it was supposed to happen so i could be 
talk about it in this video. So I will think about that while I'm shopping. While we're talking about chips, we really like these and they go well with like sandwiches and stuff and my kids like them, so. And they're super cheap, look like that. I usually always get this if um, we go somewhere, like drop the kids off at um, a parent's place and we just need something quick. This is always just the best thing so that you don't have to think too much. <laughs> so we always have these on hand. Oh, and I just remembered we don't have any pasta. And I feel like that's just one of those things you always need. So I'm trying to think which ones. Elbow macaroni for sure, 188. There's also some spaghetti, maybe. You want options. 189. Guys, I almost passed it. This is the best tomato soup you'll ever have. Literally, tomato and sweet basil. Trust me, it is the best one you'll ever have. And there's more than enough. Like, me and Matt will normally split this in half. It's 269. I think that's pretty good. Okay, we just ran out of this minced garlic. I know it's probably better to like cut the garlic yourself, but this is such a time saver, dude. It's only $1.99 and it lasts so long. So I'm definitely getting this. Okay, and then my kids and I <laughs> love Reese's Puffs. I know this is the off-brand one, but love them. Haven't had in a few weeks, so I know they'll be happy to see this. Okay, also, Matt randomly has had the desire to like cook random things. And one of the, he's found this like popcorn chicken recipe and it had like Rice Krispies in it. So I think I'm gonna get it. It's only 169 and also we can make Rice Krispie treats too. So I need to get marshmallows as well. Oh, 89 cent ones. Because Matt and I love making s'mores, so I have to take cream crackers as well. I don't know which ones to get. Should I get both of them? Because this would be good for the Ice crispy Cakes, and this would be good for s'mores. <laughs> okay. My kids love yogurt. I'm kind of skeptical with that one, so I'm going to go all the way there. Love the strawberry one. And this has only two grams of sugar apparently so mix up with some granola my kids love it i always need a bunch of butter so I'm gonna, this is the one i always get right here oh and then you should get one of these a week because my kids love hot dogs and this is just the best i can do <laughs> for kids that love hot dogs so Okay, honestly, I'm trying to think. Aldi doesn't really have like meals that you can eat, like sandwiches, prep sandwiches. They have prep salad, but I don't really want to get anything that just because it's healthy. Like I don't want to get anything that he wouldn't eat. So I might get something like this. Like you can just straight eat it. I mean, it's not that much, but I'll get chips with this. You know what I'm saying? It's better than nothing and it's, it has meat and stuff. All right, guys, we always get this. Always, always, always. They're so good. They really are terrific for tacos. I don't always like to get the one in the front, so let me get this one. Yes. My kids love string cheese, so if I have to get it, I'll get the one that says lights on it. <laughs> it comes with a lot. And then we also use a lot of mozzarella, so I'm gonna get this one organic. Okay, lately we've been doing um, pizza on biscuits, because I can make so many the flaky ones you just like cut and then make round little pizzas love that and then i was actually wondering if i should get a lunchable i think that's like a little bit better so like when i compare this with like a lunchable i think i'm not just gonna lunchable i know it's not the healthiest but it just it suffices as like kind of a meal so i'm gonna just get this instead Okay, and I don't love deli turkey meat, but my kids do, and I feel like it's just more important that they eat, you know what I mean? So, I don't really wanna get like such a big pack though. I feel like they only have really big packs, but I guess it'll last a while. And then, love, guys, you already know if you watch my videos, these are the best cinnamon rolls, way better than the Pillsbury Doughboy. 
Okay, and honestly, I have yet to find really good sausages, chicken sausages. I'm just gonna get this one. Gotten it before. It tastes pretty good in pastas and stuff, so I'm gonna do that. We had our run with the tofu, but it's not filling. Not very filling. So I'm gonna, instead of that, I'll do the same sauce and I'll get chicken. So normally, they have it. You can see my reflection. Right here is the one that we always get. Oh, this one has garlic and herb seasoning, but I'm gonna just get the plain one. Definitely want to get the broccoli florets. The really good when they're oven baked, like I made for the first time in the video. And then always need mixed vegetables. This one. It's good. I can't find the other one. Oh my gosh! And then we just ran out of these. This is what I always use to mix with our eggs. They're so good, guys. Okay, and then I love to always get at least one of these California medleys. Okay, so I think I'm gonna get French bread pizza because there's some days where I'm just like not, I can't cook. I'm just not in the mood or really busy. This always comes in really clutch. And let's see if there's anything else. My kids are really into smoothies, so I'm definitely gonna get more pineapple chunks. They go through that. I just really do pineapple and banana, and they really like the way it tastes. So I don't. I used to get a bunch of fruits, but they just really like the pineapple and banana. Okay, literally just run out of Dino Nuggies. We always get these. Those little different. Oh, this one's really big. Oh, it's just so funny. I literally looked up so many ingredients for her. They're so sweet. <laughs> Cause I recently, like I think even this was something that I was like trying to make. It's actually very interesting. I don't have all that like spinach, eggs, beans. Like that's easy to make. Oh my gosh. I mean, I'm not gonna get this cause I really only came to get food. But she also has. Oh, that's so cool. I like mentioned her in a different video. But that's really cool. I didn't know her. they would sell her book here. Shout out. So sometimes my kids really just like chicken soup and rice and this one is really good so I'm gonna get that some other stuff I forgot also we already have like a huge container of eggs but I just feel like we go through them so fast so I'm gonna just get eggs it's better to have more eggs than to not have eggs so it's always a good idea to check them so let's see Oh, see, this one is cracked. I'm really glad I checked that because then if it's cracked, you cannot get it. So. Okay, I looked at my grocery list and I forgot to get this. This is good for like the steak rolls and then also if we eat meatball subs. This is good. We love our bread. Okay, and then just to honor what he asked for, chips, I am just gonna get like a small bag. So they don't really have like small bags of chips here. So I feel like Pringles is good. I think I'm gonna just do the original. This is the Aldi brand. <laughs> the original, you can't go wrong with that. And then I forgot marinara sauce, which is right in front of me. I'll just get this. I normally don't get the glass ones, but this is fine. It's nice and big. All right, my cart is getting really full. I think I'm actually done. Well, let me just check again. Okay, I came back to the front because I knew they would have graham crackers. The the same i'll get this well should i get this now? actually i'm just i think i'm gonna just get the regular matt does not like the smell of cinnamon fun fact put that there just look at any other i think we're good here probably shouldn't get too many of these snacks anyways okay i think i am gonna get this i wanted to kind of stop doing ground beef for taco tuesday but my kids really like it it just was the type of taco meat i got last time so let's go get some taco meat Okay, this is the one I got last time. It was like super pink. This one I think is the one I'll go for. Also, my kids have been super into smoothies these days and this is the liquid base I use for all of our smoothies and it just makes it taste really good. So I'm gonna get some more apple juice. Okay, I'm back here. The last thing I forgot to get was some waffles. Cause I usually do this every Sunday. 
I was looking for the protein ones, but they didn't have it, so that's all right. These are cheaper. I think I'm done, guys. I really think I am. So here I'm just bagging everything. Um, Aldi's really good about just, you know, you check your items out, you give them the cart, and then you bag it yourself. I feel like this saves just so much time, so I just love how Aldi does everything. Hi. I just got you some chips and then a lunchable. You're welcome. God bless you. Thank you, beautiful. And I was like, God bless you. I feel like I always have to say God bless you because I want people to know it's from God. Um, you seem really appreciative. You know, so I'm, I'm very proud of you. I really haven't done that in a long time. So it's all good to do that. Okay. Just like that. I got my quarterback. <laughs> definitely a great way to like keep the parking lots clean no grocery I mean no shopping carts are just kind of like in the parking lot which is really nice something I really like but yeah um, I hope you guys enjoyed my grocery shopping with me video um, definitely got some looks here and there but nothing crazy and um, I'm actually not completely done I just have to go to target and um get like things like creamer and like that's where i'll get like the diapers and stuff like that so i was thinking about going home taking the kids to come with me to get them out the house um but yeah that's my aldi grocery shopping list it actually wasn't that bad it was 160 i always kind of range 150 to 170 um and saying that i got some extra things i normally don't get but then my parents also got things i mean i guess i ended up eating out so 160 for the week for family of four let me know what you guys think if that's good bad could do better and obviously you see we're um right now if you're interested we are still doing vegan meals we'll do like usually heavy veggie lunches but then like meat for dinner if that makes sense but anyways um hope you guys enjoyed and i'll see you in the next one bye <laughs> my aldi quarter holding bye i always put it right here